Yo, guys, check it out. I'm about to hit a crazy trick. Boom! Did you guys see that? Uh, that was okay, but, uh, check this out. This trick is gonna be crazy, and, uh... Whoa! Ow! Oi! Oof! That looked like it hurt! Yeah, that's why you guys gotta wear a helmet like me. Uh, Cam, how do you even wear a helmet like that when you're skateboarding? That thing looks so heavy! Yeah, how do you even see all that other thing? It requires a lot of skill, bro. That's all I gotta say. Oh, wait, guys. I don't know about you, but I'm getting kind of hungry. You guys wanna go to the store and get some snacks? Oh, yeah, definitely. Let's go! Let's go! All right, I'm pretty sure the store is this way, so we just gotta keep skateboarding to the store. Let's go! Wait! What's this, Dash? And wait, what, what's why? What? Wanted... $1,000 reward. Wait, hold on. What is it? And, uh, what, what, what is this, guys? What, what are you looking at? It looks just like you. Yeah, I was gonna say, it looks like you, Dash. Are you wanted? Wait, what? Guys, this does not look like me. What are you talking about? That face looks completely different. Um, I guess the only thing different is that it's in black and white. What? What are you talking about? No, look, the facial shape is, like, completely different from mine. What? I don't know what you're talking about. They just can't get your nose right. Uh, yeah, I don't know. It does look like you very much. Well, guys, do you really think I'm a criminal why would i be wanted it's obviously another guy wait that's true you've just been skateboarding with us and yeah i haven't done anything wrong i don't know what this sign is for but uh, let's just keep going to the store yeah, okay yeah let's just keep going let's go and all right here guys check this out i'm about to hit another trick and wait is that another wanted poster man this guy must have done a really bad crime yeah his face is all over town what did he do wait yeah there's another sign over here okay wow uh, let's just go to the grocery store yeah this is making me feel a little funny and oh guys there's the store what are you guys gonna get oh i want some sour strips I'm gonna get some chippies. I'm gonna get some apples. I'm pretty sure those are the healthiest. And <gasps> they have golden apples. Those are my favorite. Golden, well, let's go. Let's go. I can't wait to get these golden apples. Whoa, whoa, whoa wait. Uh, kids, uh, they, do you mind if I stop you for a second? And, oh, yeah. Yeah, sure, officer. What's up? Uh, nothing. I feel like I recognize you from somewhere. Well, I guess that would make sense. We live here. And yeah, wait. Uh, we're around this store pretty often. I come here to get snacks, you know? Yeah, it's our favorite store. Uh, yeah, no. I feel like I've seen you very recently. Uh, we've been looking for a suspect that looks similar to you. And oh, wait, guys. I think he's talking about those wanted signs. Yeah, we saw those wanted signs all around the city. They had, like, some guy's face on it that looked kind of like me. But it wasn't me. I didn't do the crime. Mm, I don't know. I can't trust you that quickly. Wait, what even was the crime that that guy committed? Oh, uh, it was horrible. Four to six counts of grand theft of carrots. Uh, what? He stole carrots? Oh, yikes. That is pretty bad. But yeah, I would never do that. Plus, our faces look completely different. I barely look like that guy. Yeah, Dash's favorite food is apples anyways. Mm, I'm not too sure. I, I may have to take you in for some questioning. Uh, for now, you're under arrest. Uh, oh, what? what? I, you're not taking me under arrest. Guys, run! Get away! Go, 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 go! Hey, they're getting away! This police this guy is crazy. That guy really tried to arrest me. Guys, skateboard away as fast as you can. I'm trying. I'm trying. I keep on crashing into stuff. We gotta get away from that guy. <gasps> Wait, there's a forest over there. Everyone to the forest. I'm just gonna give up on my skateboard and start running. To the forest. Run, run, run. I don't think he'll be able to catch us in here. And Wait, hold on. Did anyone see him following us? Is he behind us? I don't know. I think he was. I think he's getting back up. Oh, gosh. Well, guys, let's just keep going deeper in the forest. We gotta stay hidden in here. That cop was crazy. Yeah, that guy was crazy. Crazy weird. Uh, wait, Dash, did you actually steal carrots, though? It, what? No, guys, it wasn't me. I told you this. I didn't steal carrots. Why would I steal carrots? Uh, I don't know. Liking apples is a good cover-up. Yeah, we just have to ask. What, guys? It wasn't me. I didn't commit any carrot crimes, okay? But uh, let's just stay in this forest for now until all this blows off. I'm sure the cops will find the real criminal soon. Yeah, but you did run away from a police officer, so we're probably very suspicious right now. Yeah, but he was crazy. He tried to arrest me without any proof. Well, well I mean, he just wanted to ask you some questions, and he ran away. He was trying to handcuff our friend. Yeah, did you see him? He literally pulled out handcuffs. Yeah, but that doesn't mean you were going to go to jail. He said you're under arrest. You know what, you guys? Let's just roam this forest for now. I don't want to worry about this. Yeah, um, are there any good hiding spots here? I don't know. Let's just go deeper in the forest and just stay there for now. Oh, uh, we've been here forever, Dash. Can we leave? And, okay, fine. Yeah, I think we've been in this forest for long enough. Hopefully that cop isn't chasing us anymore. But We should go check. Yeah, um, we came from this way, right? I think so. You know, I can't wait. I'm starving. I want to get out of this forest. You're always starving, Cam. <sighs> Guys, let's just get out of the forest for now. We can worry about food later and... Wait, hold on. Were those cars there when we came in? Uh, I don't think so. Uh, I think I see at least, like, two and, cars. Uh, it's way more than two cars. Wait a minute, guys. Those are not normal cars. Those are police cars. Oh, gosh. There's even a helicopter. What the? They got the whole squad on us. Come on out, Steven. We've got the whole place surrounded. And, uh, wait a minute, guys. Uh, I think Steven is the person who uh, stole those carrots. Uh, Dash, is your middle name Steven? And, what? No, guys. My middle name is not Steven. My name is Dash, but oh, no. What do we do? We're not letting you get away with those 46 counts of grand theft of carrots. Uh, oh, gosh, guys. Uh, they're probably gonna come into the forest soon. We got 
gotta run! Yeah, these guys really want their carrots back. How are we supposed to leave? I'm starving! Uh, oh gosh, oh gosh. Well, surely there's like some place in this forest that they don't have surrounded. Maybe we can go this way. Oh, okay, good idea. There's no way they surrounded the entire forest and... Oh, yes, okay, guys, I don't see any cop cars over here. I think that's where we have to escape from. Go, go, go! Oh, slow down. I'm so hungry. I can't even spread. Cam, just keep running. We can't get caught by those cops. But anyways, we escaped the forest. But uh, guys, how do we get back into the city without getting caught? Uh, I don't know. Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. Okay, this whole thing is a lot bigger of a deal than I thought it was. What do we do? Guys, breathe. Don't panic. I'm not panicking. But guys, they literally think I stole carrots. We, we got to do something about this. Uh, well, can you prove yourself innocent? Mm, I mean, I am innocent, but I don't know how to prove it. What can we do? And... <gasps> Wait a minute. Guys, why don't we go find the real criminal who stole those carrots? His name was Steven, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Now that we know his name, we can find him ourselves. Yeah, if we find the real criminal and then turn him into the cops, then they're not going to be going after me anymore. And then we'll clear your name. Oh, yeah, that's an excellent idea. Let's go. Okay, okay, well, yeah, now we just got to go find this real criminal. So, uh, well, where do we look? He was a carrot thief, right? Where would a carrot thief hang out? Uh, probably at a farm like this one, right? And wait a minute. Yeah, hold on. This looks like a farm over here. I guess we can go inside, but guys, we got to be careful. If we get caught around a farm, do you know how suspicious that would look? They're going to think that I'm stealing the carrots. Well, I'll take a look around. I don't see anything. I don't see anything from up here. Yeah, wait, there's a lot of carrots over here that no one has stolen so far. Uh, I don't see any other people here. Uh, the carrot chest is empty. Well, it looks like there's a lot of other farms around here. Maybe we can go look around them. Maybe we can find this Steven guy. Let's just keep looking around. I don't know. Maybe he already stole from these places. Well, I mean, this place right here looks like a barn. Here, everyone, let's just hit the road. Let's just go around this entire place and look around for any carrot farms. And wait, guys, there's a big barn over there. Maybe we can stop and look inside to see if we can find the criminal. Oh, yeah, that's probably a good idea. And, oh, wait, that's an ice cream stop. Can we go there? And Wait, what? Ice cream store? And Oh, yeah, I guess there's an ice cream store there. Um, Are you sure that's a good idea, though? You know, the, maybe the, the person in the store knows my face from the posters and wants to turn me in? It's out of nowhere. No worries. Let's go. Oh, gosh. All right. Well, uh, I guess we can go in. Uh, I don't really want ice cream, though, so I guess you can just order. Okay. Uh, can I have a scoop of strawberry and then a scoop of vanilla and then a scoop of... Cam, do you want ice cream? Uh, 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 Ruby, just get me uh, three scoops of uh, double double chocolate chocolate. Okay, but I'm not done ordering yet. And then I want a banana. Okay, I want another scoop of vanilla and, and then uh, some Ruby, and stop coaches. taking so long to order. Don't forget, we need to go find this criminal. Wait a second, okay? Don't rush me. Oh my gosh. And wait a minute. Hold on. Do you guys see that guy over there? It looks like he's farming some carrots, but wait, he doesn't look like a farmer. <gasps> wait, that's the guy. Wait, uh, he's there. We need to get him. Go, go, go. Hey, Steven, we found you. Come here. Wait, I'll catch up with you guys in a second. I'm trying to get my ice cream. What? Okay, whatever, but hey, yo, Steven, come here. We know who you are. Come here, Steven. We're, we're gonna turn you in. You're not getting away with those 46 carrots. Come here, buddy. Come on, come on, come on. He's trying to get away. We just gotta keep chasing him. Come here, Steven. Come here. Come here, Steven. We're gonna turn you in. Why does your face have to look so similar to mine? Come back here, you imposter. Yeah, wait, he's the imposter. I'm the real one. Uh, wait, is he getting in a car? We have to stop him. Come here, get him. Come on, come on, come and, on, come on. Oh, Aww. no, he's getting away. Wait, hold on. We have to chase after him quick. Hop on your skateboard. Go, go, go. All right, I'm coming, I'm coming. Just keep chasing after him. Our skateboards are fast enough. We just gotta keep going. And oh, no. Okay, I think we kind of lost him. Which way did he go? Uh, I don't know. Let's just follow the main road. Oh, gosh. All right, well, hopefully he went this way. Let's just keep going. And wait, there he is. He's right over there. Okay, we just gotta keep going after him then. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Come here, Steven. You're not getting away with this. We have to catch up. And, oh, gosh. His car is so much faster than ours, but let's just keep following the main road. And oh, gosh. Wait, hold on. There's a turn here. Which way should we go? Uh, I guess right. Uh, all right, right it is. Hopefully he went this way. And, oh, gosh. Where are we going? Where is this Steven guy leading us? Uh, I have no clue, but we need to catch up to him and catch him. I've never been to this part of town before, but let's go. Yeah, I haven't been here either. And wait a minute. What even is this building over here? I don't think I've ever seen this place before. And uh, wait, is that Steven in a plane? Wait, we gotta go stop him. Hey, come here, come here. And, oh, no. Uh, he's flying away. What do we do now? Uh, maybe there's another plane. Uh, uh, maybe it's in the hangar. Uh, any planes over here? I don't. I don't see anything. I don't even know how we can get in. And oh gosh, yeah, he's gone for good. What do we do? I have no clue. There's nothing around back. Oh gosh. Well, now that Steven's not here, the cops are obviously gonna just blame it on me. And oh, hi, Ruby. Hi guys. 
just... How did you find us? Uh, I just walked down the main road. Oh, fair enough. But what do we do? Steven just got away. Oh, wait, you guys didn't catch that guy? No, he had a car and a plane. He had a perfect getaway. Yeah, he got away. He only left some carrots behind. Oh, I guess that means we weren't going to get him in the first place. Oh, gosh. But now the cops are going to blame me for that guy's crimes. What do we do? Well, the first thing, uh, you should probably throw away those carrots. And, oh, gosh, yeah. These are illegal carrots. I cannot be holding these right now. I'm going to toss them across this fence. Yeet. There we go. But, guys, I need somewhere to hide out. Can I hide in one of your guys' house? Wait, no. They're going to just find you. No, we need to make something hidden to keep Dash out safe. Ooh, like a hidden base. That's a good idea. We got to make somewhere where the cops are never going to find me. But hold on. Where should we build a hidden base? And oh, wait, maybe in the forest over there. Oh, yeah. They couldn't find us in the forest before. Yeah, yeah. I think the forest is the ultimate move. Plus, we're like kind of far away from the main city over here. So this should be a good spot. Okay, this way, this way. All right, let's go. We just got to keep going deep into the forest. There's no way the police are going to find us here. But guys, we should make this like really, really hidden because if Dash gets caught, then uh, he's going to jail. Oh, True. Oh, gosh. Yeah, you're right. But hold on a minute. It looks like there's some buildings over there. We should probably get far away from those because we don't want any people to see us. Yeah, that's what I was about to say. Um, Down here, it looks pretty empty. Down here looks pretty good. And okay, this actually looks like the perfect spot. But anyways, guys, uh, where should we build the entrance of this base? We got to make it super secret. Mm, what about under a tree? Ooh, that's a pretty good idea. We could just do it like underneath this tree over here. But oh, guys, I have a better idea. What we could do is grab a few ghost blocks and just put those down right over here like this and check it out pretty much they look like normal blocks but we can go through them wait that's an excellent idea this is the most hidden spot ever okay let's do this but we also gotta dig a little staircase underneath the tree so that we can actually go down oh yeah uh you dig down and then we'll follow you after okay all right all right here let me dig down a little bit i'm just gonna put this ladder down here and all right i think you guys should be able to come through yes all right let's go this is actually awesome the cops are never gonna be able to find this this is super well hidden but anyways guys now that we've got a small hidden room down here we gotta actually make this place up uh, nice to live in if i'm gonna be staying here here. What? This isn't good enough for you? What? No, of course not. The walls are all made out of dirt. I don't want to live in a dirt hole. Oh, true. That would be pretty boring. Uh, and very gross. We need this to be like a, a five-star underground bunker. Yeah, but hold on a minute, guys. We're kind of close to the surface right now. I think we should probably dig a little bit deeper. Let's go like this deep. This way, no one's ever going to be able to find us. Ooh, all right. Let's just go ahead and cover up this ladder all the way up here. And okay, I think down here should definitely be deep enough. Now, what we got to do is clear out some space. All right, let's make this spot huge. Yeah, we gotta make this room big. And wait, do you guys plan on living down here with me? Uh, I, I'll come and visit. Yeah. All right, all right. But anyways, let's just clear out a bunch of space down here. We gotta have this place be really nice and spacious if I'm gonna be living down here. Okay, how does this look for you? This is a pretty good start, but we gotta make it a lot bigger. Is this really not big enough for you, dude? What? No way. We gotta make this place huge. We gotta have room for everything I'll ever need to live. Because, you know, if I go out of this place, then I'll get caught. Oh, actually, yeah, that makes sense. Yeah, I'm not gonna be able to go to the grocery store or anything. So we gotta build our own grocery store down here but anyways this looks like a pretty good start i think the next thing we gotta do is make the walls of this room look nice so uh what should we set the walls into mm, what about iron Ooh, wait iron block sounds like a good idea let's do it all right let's just set all of the walls of this room into some iron blocks that way it'll be strong and keep the police out yep if the police try breaking in through the walls they're not gonna be able to get through yeah this should be more than enough let's go yeah this room is gonna look awesome and here let's also set the floor into something nice what about a little bit of uh spruce wood since we're in a spruce biome. Oh, yeah, I guess that works. Yeah, that'll be pretty natural. So there we go. And all right, nice. The base of this room is looking sick, but oh, wait, hold on, guys. One last thing. We forgot the roof. Oh, yeah, that's definitely important. Yep, I would not want this ceiling collapsing on me. That would be uh pretty bad. All right, and there we go. The roof is now done. This place is actually looking pretty good, but anyways, now that we got the basic room done, what do I need to build first in order to live down here? And oh, wait, probably some food, right? Because uh, the food is going to be important. I don't want to starve. Yeah, you kind of do need to eat, but maybe not carrots. Yeah, anything other than carrots. That would look very suspicious. So why don't we make a little kitchen over here? What we could do is clear out a little room for a kitchen. We could just dig into the wall like this and uh, let's just build like a whole new room for the kitchen. This is going to take forever to clear out. And yeah, you're right. But hold on a minute. I have an idea. Why don't we use some TNT to clear out this room for us? Oh, wait, that'll be pretty efficient. Just to uh, uh, make sure it's not too loud. Oh, yeah, we do not want the cops coming into here. But what we got to do is just put a little bit of TNT on the walls like this and uh, let's just light it all at the same time. Quick, go, 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 and run! Okay, I hope that isn't too loud. Oh, gosh, that was pretty loud. Hopefully no one outside heard that, but, hey, it did clear out a bunch of space. Yeah, 
there should be plenty of room for a kitchen. Yep, let's go. But right now, this doesn't really look like a kitchen at all. We gotta make the walls and everything look nice as well. So, hmm, what should we make the walls of the kitchen out of? Mm, a kitchen? Uh, what about, like, stone bricks? Ooh, wait, actually, that's a good idea. I like that. Let's do stone bricks. Let me just grab a few of those. And, yeah, we can just set the entire walls of this kitchen into some stone bricks. And then we can also set the floor into some more spruce planks. I think that should look pretty good. Yep. I'll start on the walls over here. I'll do some of the ceiling. All right, and boom, there we go. This kitchen room is looking awesome. But anyway, guys, now we gotta put some actual food in here. And we gotta have enough food so that I don't ever have to go to a grocery store. Okay, well, let's just put some barrels down over here. Yeah, we're gonna need a lot of storage. We can have some barrels, a few chests over here like that. Make it symmetrical. Let's have a few refrigerators for, you know, a cold food. We can have, like, one on that side, another one over here on this side. And all right, this is looking pretty good. But now we need some actual food to put inside of them. So uh, first things first, let's grab some steak. Ooh, yeah, steak is your favorite. I'm gonna put a bunch of steak inside of this chest over here. And ooh, wait, also some golden apples. Those are gonna be really good. Let me just eat those in over here like that. And all right, that is looking pretty good. Okay, now we have your steak and your apples. But uh, wait, what about food that we like? And wait, what? I, I thought you guys weren't gonna stay down here. Yeah, but now that I realize it, uh, we kind of did help you run away from cops and uh, hid in a forest with you. And yeah, we're kind of wanted as well, probably. And, oh, gosh. Yeah, you're right. Wait, that means we got to make this base for like all three of us. Okay, well, hold on. What type of food do you guys want? Mm. I want something sweet. What about some watermelons? Uh, okay, that's fine. I was thinking more about, uh, like... How about some of this? What? Ew, that's so gross! How is that gross? It's a carved melon! Wait, 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 wait. Hold on, let me, uh, let me, uh, there we go. Oh, hi, everybody! Ah, stop it! What about this one? <laughs> wait, 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 that one's scary! Okay, stop it, stop it, stop it, stop it, stop it, stop it! I wanted cupcakes instead! And, what, cupcakes? Okay, fine, fine, fine. We can have a few cupcakes inside of the barrel over here, but, hmm, what else? Cupcakes aren't gonna be a good food, you know? Those are kind of more of a dessert. <gasps> wait, uh, what about this? It's called the cake oven? What, a cake oven? What did I just say with having dessert? We need some real food in here. Well, I know, but, like, if we want to cook a cake, we could have a cake of... I was suggesting one, but Ruby's took it out of hand. Okay, fine. We can have a few cake ovens, but, guys, we also need some real food in here. Okay, let's see. What type of real food are we working with here? And, uh... Ooh, wait. What about some rabbit stew? Oh, yeah. What about this a crowbar? looks awesome. That is not food. Oh, wait. This rabbit stew actually looks pretty good. We could eat a little bit of that in there. There we go. But, guys, we still got a lot of unfilled barrels. We need some more food in here. So, uh... Ooh, what about some chicken, some pork chops? Wait, hold on. I'm pretty sure that officer's name was pork chop. What about some beef? Beetroot soup. I'm not gonna lie, beetroot soup kind of looks disgusting, but hey, we've got a lot of storage. We can put that in there. Let's just put everything inside of these barrels. Boom! There we go. And okay, I think all the barrels are filled now. Let's go! Yeah, but the chests aren't. Oh yeah, you're right. We still have two chests over here. Alright, what should we put in those? Mm, let's put in some, um, potions of healing. Pizza! What? Wait, there's pizza? Wait, can I see? And, oh no, dude's got a lot of pizza. I guess we can have a little bit of pizza, but what else? What else? We gotta find some healthy food. What about an empowered remnant? What in the world is an empowered Powered remnants and oh potions of healing. Yeah, I think potions of healing are probably for the best Let's have those in there and uh, I guess we can just save the fridges in case we get any cold food We don't need to fill them up right now, but anyways this kitchen is looking pretty good. What is that? Trumpet. That's not a food. How do you have a trumpet? Wait, I want to get one. Wait, can you play it? Wait, how do you play it? I can't do it uh, Well, you just uh, you breathe into it and then you go. <laughs> uh, okay I don't think there's a good idea, but guys hold on our kitchen still isn't done yet We still need a table and chairs and all that So let me grab a table really quick and also a few chairs and ooh wait guys Why don't we use this purple stained glass table. This thing looks awesome. What? That looks cool. We can have that, and then we also gotta grab a few chairs, and let's just put those chairs all around the table. We can have a few there, like that, one over there, one over there, and yeah, this is looking pretty good. But not these chairs. Let's do some fancy chairs, like this. Wait, is there such thing as glass chairs? And oh, uh, I guess we can use these chairs. These look pretty nice. But anyways, we've got the tables and chairs done. The last thing that we need inside of our kitchen is, you know, like an oven and everything to cook stuff in. So let me grab an oven really quick. You just put the oven down right over here. I was thinking, let's just put down an oven like that. And then, oh, wait, we also need to have a kitchen sink for washing our hands because that's going to be very important. All right. But anyways, I think the kitchen is about done now. And wait, oh, what's this thing over here? Why is, why do we have a brick? column in our kitchen. I don't know. Fair enough. I guess we can use it to stabilize the walls and make sure that the ceiling doesn't fall down. It looks kind of cool. I like it. I like it. Wait, hold on. Can we put a beacon in the middle of this one? Ooh, that looks kind of cool. Okay, that actually looks cool. Whoa, that looks awesome. 
Damn. Wait, we can use this like in here. Ooh, yeah. Wait, hold on. There's actually some good decoration. We should put it all over this room. Yeah, space them out uh, every three blocks. All right, let's do it. Oh, this is looking sick. This is like very futuristic. This base is actually looking awesome. We're like in a spaceship. Let's go. But anyways, now that we have all of these beacon lighting decoration thingies done, what's the next thing that we should build? Hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh, do we need our bedrooms? And oh, wait a minute. Yeah, you're right. We're probably gonna need a bedroom because uh, sleeping on the floor does not sound too fun. So, ooh, wait, why don't we just build the bedrooms area right over here? Okay, I call this one. Ooh, yeah, yeah. We can just each dig into the wall and have our own bedroom. I'm gonna build my bedroom over here and I'm just gonna have a little staircase going downwards just like this. I'm gonna have my bedroom on a lower floor. It's gonna look sick. Yeah, I'm making my bedroom look sick. I'm just gonna make mine look pretty cozy. Bedrooms are definitely gonna be important if we plan to stay here for a while. And oh, hi there. Cam, how's it going? Uh, hi, uh, why are you in my room? Uh, <laughs> nothing, nothing. Don't worry about it. I was just uh, digging up. Uh-huh, yeah, well... This is my room. Why, why are you making your room so deep? Uh, you'll see, but I need this space. What? Okay, you know what? Fine. I'm just gonna build the other way. Sweet. Thank you. All right, well, here. The first thing I gotta do for my room is, of course, clear out a bunch of space. So, let me just go all the way out here and then just start digging. Let's go. This bedroom is actually going to look awesome. And here, since I built the stairs over here out of sandstone, I'm gonna make the whole theme of my bedroom sandstone. So, let me grab a little bit more of this stuff and let's just build the entire walls out of it. This could look pretty cool. I'm gonna make my bedroom sandstone and purple themed. I think that could look pretty sick. We could just have most of the wall be made out of sandstone, and then we could have like little stripes of purple going through it like that. Or actually, even better, what we could do is just have like a big line of purple going in through the top. Yeah, this could look sick. How's your guys' bedrooms going? Mine is looking pretty awesome so far. Mine's looking pretty pretty cool, if I do say so myself. Mine's looking awesome, yeah. Ooh, alright, alright, wait, hold on, Cam. I want to see what yours is looking like. I'm just gonna dig in over here really quick and oh, do wait, do you have a bunch of glass down here? Is that what you use that space for? Yep. Fair enough, but here, I'm just gonna keep working on my sandstone walls. This stuff is gonna look awesome. Let me just put a layer of purple over here real quick. There we go. And then we gotta put some more sandstone down here. And all right, this is actually looking pretty cool. Now let me just go ahead and set all of the floor to sandstone as well. And oh, wait, hold on, Cam. I'm gonna have to dig into your wall a little bit, but I'm just gonna replace it with sandstone. Is that all right? Uh, I was gonna do something else. Uh, maybe like some yellow wool concrete. Uh, no, sandstone it is. You gotta deal with it. Uh... What? You just changed it to yellow concrete. I said it was supposed to be sandstone. I told you I was doing the yellow concrete. You got out of my way. <laughs> Uh, no, I started building first, no, okay? No, no. All right, well, let's do half and half. Uh, we'll do uh, this half yellow. No, 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 no. Let's have the bottom half be made out of sandstone. Okay, that makes sense. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That, that's good. No, how about like that? Yeah, there we go. That looks better. Uh, what about like that? Uh, okay, fine. That's acceptable. Are you guys arguing over there? No, no, no. It's nothing. It's nothing. But anyways, now the next thing I got to do is set my entire roof into something nice. So I guess I can just clear out all of this stone and let's set the roof into some more sandstone. And there we go. Now the base of my bedroom is complete. Now I got to actually start adding some beds and stuff in here. So let me go. Go ahead and grab a few purple beds. Anyway, why do I hear so many slime sounds from over here? Cam, are you doing something in your room with slime and, uh, oh, what, what is this? Pineapple and starfish. Uh, 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 what, pineapple and starfish? What is the point of this? My bed, dude. What the heck? This seems like a very uncomfortable bed. There's literally holes in it. It looks like a big cheese donut. Um, actually, it's very comfortable. Just mind your own beeswax, bro. Uh, okay, okay, fine, fine, fine. But anyways, let me go back in my room. I gotta put down some beds over here. Actually, I'm just gonna put down one bed and then I'm gonna put down a bedside cabinet on each side of the bed. So, ooh, wait, let me grab this blue one over here. Let me put that on each side of the bed, and then oh, I have a really cool idea for what I could do. Let me grab a little bit of glass and some lava, and what I'm gonna do is build my very own lava lamp around my room. I'm just gonna have, like, a bunch of lava with some glass around it like that, and ooh, all right, that is looking awesome. Let's do another one of those in this corner of the room, and then another one in this corner as well, and all right, let's go. This is looking awesome. But anyways, let's see. What else am I gonna need inside of my bedroom. I guess I'm gonna need a little bit of storage, so let me grab some chests, and we can have our chest area be right over here like this. This could be all of the chest storage, and ooh, wait, I should also probably put down a little bit of armor. Let me grab some smooth stone really quick, and some armor stands, and here, I'm just gonna put down some smooth stone over here like this, with some armor stands on top of them like that, and hold on a minute, everyone, you guys should probably find some armor as well. We should all put armor inside of our bedrooms. That way, in case the cops raid us, we'll have, uh, you know, some armor to protect ourselves. Wait, that is kind of smart, actually. I don't have enough room. And, uh, what do you mean you don't have enough room? You can make some room. All you gotta do is just, uh, yeah, just dig into the wall and then, uh, just put down, like, a smooth stone and armor stand. There you go. Wait, I'm gonna make this sick. Hold on. All right, all right. But anyways, let's see. 
what do I need to put on my armor stand? I need to find some really good armor that I could use. So let me just search armor real quick. And all right, what are we working with here? Ooh, wait, we got a lot of good stuff. Wait, hold on a minute, guys. There's ghillie suits. Let me try putting this on real quick. Is this just gonna make me look like grass? And <gasps> yo, wait, I look like leaf. Wait, hold on. I'm gonna try sneaking up on Cam and Ruby. Let me just uh, sneak up on Cam over here really quick. Uh, I'm just gonna go behind him. I don't think he even sees me right now. Oh, this thing is so hard to. What, what in the world is Cam just doing? Need to turn around. <laughs> and, uh, uh, game, it, it, it's me, it's me, it's Dash. Uh, let me out of here, let me out of here, let me out of here. I don't call the cops, cops, cops. No, game, stop calling the cops. Game, I, I gotta take off the armor. Game, it's me, it's me behind you. Wait, is the SWAT team here? Uh, no, no, Ruby, that was Kim. Oh. There was a giant leaf monster. Uh, oh, Kim, I don't think that was a leaf monster. What are you talking about? It was giant, leafy, and monster shape. Okay, well, I think we tricked Cam pretty good, but hold on. I want to see what Ruby's reaction is going to be if I put on this ghillie suit armor. Let's just pull up over here on Ruby really quick, and I'm just going to sneak up behind her. Wait, I don't think she sees me right now. It looks like she's staring at this wall. Let's just go over here, and all right, we just got to wait for her to turn around. Um, I don't know what armor to use yet, huh? Ah! Hey, Ruby, how's it going? What the heck is that? <laughs> it's me. Look, I have a. I'm wearing ghillie suit armor. It's like a leaf. Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! You gave me a heart attack. <laughs> okay, I think this armor is definitely good. I'm gonna put some of this on my armor stand. You guys should as well. Uh, okay. Uh, ooh, there's a sand one too. This one looks so cool. Yeah, there's like a sand ghillie suit armor, a snow one, and also a nether rack one. Well, we can blend in perfectly with these. Ooh, yeah, you're right. We could use this to hide from the cops. But anyways, I should also probably find another set of armor that's actually like really strong. So let's see. I need to find a strong set of armor. What are we working with here? And ooh, wait a minute. This ocean armor looks kind of cool. Let me try putting some of this on really quick. It's like super blue and <gasps> whoa, this looks awesome. Oh, I can't. Wait, are you wearing the same armor as me? Uh, I was going to show you the armor. Wait, why are you in a shopping cart? And wait, is that an engine on it? Yeah, it's my, it's my whip. What? <laughs> you have a shopping cart? Uh, okay, that's pretty interesting. But hold on. Is the blue armor good? Oh yeah, it's, it's really good. All right, all right. Well, in that case, I guess let me go ahead and put a full set of that on this armor stand. Boom, there we go. And hold on a minute. I should also probably find some weapons just in case, you know, things get dirty and I have to fight. Guys, don't forget to get some weapons. Weapons are going to be very important. And ooh, wait a minute. Hold on. I think I just found a bunch of cool ones. Whoa, wait, what is this? It's called Molten Edge. Guys, I just found an axe that's on fire. This thing looks awesome. Huh? This one's called the Awakened Lich Blade, and it goes so well with this armor. Whoa, wait, that thing looks crazy. Okay, okay, definitely use that, but hold on a minute. There's this other one. It's called the Stormbringer. I want to try this out. It's like glowing and stuff. It looks pretty wild, and whoa, this thing is awesome. Stormbringer? Does it make it rain? I don't know. I haven't checked outside. Hopefully not, though, because that would be kind of annoying. And that would make our hiding spot kind of obvious. Yeah, here. I'm just gonna put both of these weapons inside of this chest right over here, and alright, what else do we need inside of this armory area? Ooh, wait, what about a bow? Just in case, you know, the cops get a bit too close, we can use a bow to, you know, keep them away, and wait a minute, hold on, uh, I didn't find a bow, but I found, uh, a, a new table for our kitchen. Huh? What did you find? Everyone come over to the kitchen real quick. This thing looks pretty crazy. Let me just uh, replace our old table and check it out. It's a rainbow table. Yo, RGB table. This thing is awesome. Wait, wait, wait. Let me see. Let me see that. What do you think? Wait, I love it. I'm going to take these for my room. This stuff is sick. Okay, but hold on a minute. I still do need to find a bow. I have not found that yet. Let me just search up bow really quick. And okay, I think I'm going to go with this lucky bow over here. I'm pretty sure what this does is do like a different ability each time you shoot it. I'm just going to grab a lucky bow and also some arrows and let me just eat that inside of my chest right over here there we go all right but anyways i think my bedroom is about done i've got literally everything i'll ever need in here and hold on a minute are your guys' bedrooms done um, i'm putting down some tables because they're so cute Cam, is yours done uh yeah my room is set up Ooh, all right wait hold on i want to check it out i'm gonna ride into your room with this shopping cart let me just uh pull up let's go oh i think it's too big to fit through the door I'm banging on my wall that's why i have a that's why i have it outside okay okay well at least park it like next to your room don't have it in the middle of the room there we go Yo, and all right, wait, what's your room looking like? Have you made any changes? Uh, well, I have, uh, my pineapple bed and my cool rug and my, uh, my pineapple. What? This is not a pineapple. This looks like a pumpkin. Uh, look at the name of it. Wait, hold on. Let me see. Pineapple? Why is this called pineapple? I don't know. Uh, okay. Well, that's pretty cool. Can I try riding the pineapple? Yo, this thing is kind of cool. It keeps banging into the wall, though. Uh, yeah, uh, it's pretty cool, but check it out. I have the infinite void below me with the glass. It's cool effect. Ooh, so that's why you needed all that space. I guess it kind of looks cool, but hold on a minute. Ruby, I want to see what you have in your room. Can I come in? Mm-hmm. 
-hmm. All right, let's check it out. And ooh, whoa, whoa, you have so many tables. Why are they on the ceiling? Because they're pretty. I guess they kind of look like Christmas lights. You know those Christmas lights that hang down from the sky? Yeah, 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 those. It kind of looks like those. That's actually pretty cool. But anyways, this bedroom looks awesome. Whoa, what is this armor you have here? Uh, I just thought it looked cute. So I put it down and um, I'm trying to get my PC set up correct right now. Oh, fair enough. Well, you know what your room needs? What? And rod pillars. What? Ooh, wait, he's not wrong though. Those kind of look like your big things on the ceiling over here. Uh, I guess so. I guess it's fine. I'll leave it. All right, but anyway, since all of the bedrooms are pretty much done now, hmm, what else do we need to build inside of this secret bunker? And oh, wait a minute, guys. We should build some defenses just in case any cops do come by. Our defenses can take them out without us having to worry about them. Let's make a nuke silo! And no, 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 no. We're not making a nuke silo. That's going to be a little bit too much. Why don't we have like a bow turret or something? Ooh, are we going to put that right at the ladder? Yeah, yeah. Check it out. I just grabbed this heavy crossbow turret and wait, actually, instead of right at the ladder, why don't we just put it up over here? Whoa! That thing looks awesome! What the? Yeah, it looks cool, but uh, very obvious. Yeah, true. It does look pretty obvious. Okay, maybe we should put it inside, like you said earlier, Ruby. Yeah. Let's just go down here a little bit, down under the ladder, and let's just uh, dig out over here. Oh, yeah, we can have a sign where they have to read it, and it says, say hello to my little friend. Yep, and then the little friend can just be this heavy crossbow over here. <laughs> That's so scary. But hold on a minute. We should probably test this out. Let me try spawning in a zombie to see how much damage it does. I'm just going to put it down right over here. <laughs> what? Was that the crossbow? Uh, I didn't do anything. Hold on. Wait, wait, wait. Let's try that one more time. Let me try spawning it in. And oh, <laughs> what? The crossbow's one-shotting it. Uh, this is pretty dangerous. I'm going to put some signs around. Yeah, that's probably a good idea. But hold on a minute. I'm pretty sure there's other cool turrets that we can get other than this crossbow. What else can we use? Ooh, what about this one? Wait, what is this one? Uh, electromagnetic railgun. <laughs> what? Hold on, wait. Let's try breaking the other turret real quick so that we can test out this one. And all right, let's see what is this going to do. And oh, it, it, it just one shots the zombie. Nice. What if we just have like a hundred different turrets in here? Wait, hold on. What type of other turrets even are there? And whoa, wait, hold on. Firework launcher. This thing looks pretty sick. Let me put that down over there. And oh, wait, this one looks kind of smaller compared to the other ones. But let's see. Is it OP? Is it going to? Oh, wait, it, it's shooting fireworks everywhere. Whoa. Wait, it's kind of pretty. I think three of these should be enough. Yeah, I don't think we need any more than this. Yeah, I think this should be good. But Hold on a minute. One other thing that we should probably do. Everyone, let's go outside of the tree a little bit. We should spawn in some cameras up here so that we can see what's going on outside. Oh, wait. True. We can just put a camera, like, right over here. That way we can keep a good eye on the main front door. But hold on. This is kind of obvious. How about we put the camera underneath the block like that? Check it out. That one looks way more hidden. Wait, where is it? I can't find it at all. It's right here underneath the block. But let me connect my camera monitor to it really quick. And let me just take a look through. Can we have a good view from this angle? And okay, it looks like we can kind of see. <gasps> Wait, actually, no, we can see everything. We have a perfect view. This is awesome. Well, they're never going to find it. Let's go. All right, all right. Well, let's go back inside of the bunker really quick. All righty, all right. And here, what we got to do is put this camera somewhere and whoa, wait, there's a lot of danger signs here. Fair enough. Yeah, going outside is pretty dangerous now. Yeah, but here, let's go ahead and grab an item frame and uh, let's just put the camera monitor right over here. This will be the camera monitor and everyone can just use it whenever they want. Alrighty, that works for me. There's so many danger signs. It's stopping me from walking. Uh, no, you just have to go around them. Danger, danger, danger. Our base is starting to get pretty dangerous, but let's see. We've got the defenses, we've got the bedrooms, and we've got the kitchen, but hmm, what else do we need inside? out of this base. Guys, we're missing a bathroom. Oh, yeah, you're right. We don't really have a bathroom yet. Okay, well, hold on. Let's build the bathroom right over here. It should be pretty quick to build. Okay, yeah, it's just like a small room with a toilet, right? That's all we need? Yeah, yeah, just like a small room with a toilet. Let me grab a door really quick, and we can just put that down over there like that. And here, yeah, let's just go ahead and clear out a little space for this bathroom. We can make it pretty nice looking. Yep, wait, this bathroom's kind of long. And Yeah, wait, you're right. This place is a little bit big. Let's make it a bit smaller. Yeah, let's so um, just do this. Yeah, we don't need this place to be too crazy. Okay, and just a little bit of this and uh, get rid of these. Oh, uh, I think there's a gravel coming from the ceiling. Oh, Why gosh. Why is so much gravel? Oh. Oh, gosh. Wait, there's so much of it up here. What in the world? What the heck? I thought it wouldn't end. Let's just dig out all of this gravel. We do not need this here. Let's just get rid of all of this. And Okay, I, I think we've cleared out enough. Yeah, we don't need that much. Let's just uh, build around it, I guess. Yeah, yeah. We don't need too much space. Let's just go ahead and build our wall over here. And Cam, you might want to get in. You don't want to be stuck with the gravel out there. Oh, it's fine. I'm a gravel adventurer. What? Get over here. Are you torching the gravel? Ooh, that actually looks kind of satisfying. He's torturing the gravel. No, no, he's torching it. Oh, I see. Wait, Cam, we have some gravel up here if you want to get rid of this. Whoa, wait, 
we have a lot of gravel on top of us. We should probably install a ceiling like ASAP. Oh, wait, never mind. I just let some of the gravel through. I'll put down a torch. Hey, let's go. Wait, put down a torch all over this place like this. There we go. And then check this out. I'm just going to release these blocks. Let's go. Release the gravel. Gravel does not stand a chance against our torch. This is too easy. This is so oddly satisfying. But oh, wait, there's some water over here. We should probably cover that up. There we go. Okay. Oh, all the torches are gone now. Oh, all right. Well, anyways, that should be fine. I think we've cleared out enough space. Now let's go ahead and just install our ceiling. Oh, there's a little bit more gravel here. But anyways, I think this should actually be enough space now, guys. Let's just go ahead and install our ceiling really quick so that we don't have to deal with any more of this random falling gravel. I'll do the floor. I'm getting rid of it all. And, whoa, Kim. Wait, you're really going crazy on this gravel. <laughs> why, why, why? We don't actually need to get rid of all of it. I eat gravel for breakfast. What? That is gross. But anyways, uh, I, I think this bathroom should be about good now. We got a nice little room here and oh, two toilets. Yeah, facing each other. Oh, so you could like duel to see who finishes first. I was more so thinking that we can each have our own toilet. Oh, uh, I, I guess that could be kind of <laughs> nice. But anyways, the next thing that we need for the washroom is, of course, a sink, you know, so that we can wash our hands. So uh, let's just put down one of those over here, I guess. Yeah, and I'll put down some um flowers and stuff so it can smell nice in here. Oh, yeah, yeah, that's a good idea. But uh, is there anything else that we need in here? Uh, oh, maybe a trash bin. Ooh, yeah, that would be pretty good. Oh, wait, look at that one. That one looks kind of cool. We should use that. Uh, why purple, though? <laughs> why not? Okay, I'll just put some uh, flowers on top. Oh, nice. But anyways, hold on, Cam. Are you done with clearing out all that gravel yet? And oh, I do not see a single piece of gravel around here. Yeah, there's a lot. What the? Okay, well, here, get in the, the washroom. Let's go ahead and close this off. And anyways, I think the washroom should be done now. Wait, is that a plant over there? Uh, yeah, I'm just gonna plant some flowers in this corner. What the? What, okay, this is more like a plant room than a bathroom. But hey, I guess it'll smell good in here with all the plants. Yep. All right, well, let's go. The bathroom is now officially complete. But anyways, let's see. Is there anything else that we're gonna need inside of this base? And wait a minute, guys. We gotta build some sort of escape route just in case we do get raided by the cops and we're not able to fight back. We gotta have some sort of way we can escape. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we need a way to sneak back into the forest and run away. Exactly. So, uh, hmm, let's see. How could we do that? We gotta make some sort of hidden escape route that we could go through, but the cops aren't gonna be able to go through. So, oh, wait, why don't we use some more ghost blocks again? Well, we can do that, but um, how are we gonna escape? How did that Steven guy escape? Oh, he escaped through a plane and, oh, wait, are you saying we build our own escape plane? That's a good idea! Yeah! All right, but hold on. First, we got to find a place where we can actually build, like, a tunnel to get to the escape plane. Uh, should we do it in the kitchen? I think this would be a good spot. Oh, yeah, that's a pretty good spot. Wait, why not underneath the pizza ovens? And, uh, underneath the pizza ovens? That could work, but... Oh, wait a minute. Hold on. Who put these banners over here? Why don't we do it behind the banners? Oh, well, we, uh, we can do that. These are my banners, but, um, I guess it's fine. Wait, wait, hold on. What we got to do is grab some ghost blocks, and we could just put those down over here like this. And then we can put down another one of these banners on it, and now we can go go straight through it. Check it out. Wait, that's awesome. Okay, okay. Wait, this is actually the most epic escape ever. Let's just go ahead and clear out a little room behind this area so that we have some space. Okay, and I'll put back the ghost block. All right, all right. There we go. Wait, Kim, where did you go? What are you doing over here? I'm uh, making science. What? What in the world is this? Redstone. For what? What is this going to do? All right, if I put this back and then I cover this up and I get ourselves a button and do one of these. There we go. That should work. It's not working. Why are you not working? Cam, we're trying to build an escape Bro. Okay, but what, what in the world is this? This is not proper redstone here. I'm doing a doodad flip-flop. No, Kim, okay, okay, give me the redstone real quick. Let me show you how you're supposed to do this. What you have to do is have the redstone go in like this. Uh, there you go. And yeah, all right, this should work. Now, if you press this button, check it out. The, the pistons are going to move, but I don't think you can move uh, furnaces with pistons. Okay, well, I tried. I see what you were going for, though. You wanted to have like the pistons go back, and then there would be a hidden area there. Yeah, I just wanted a secret barrel. Oof, well, yeah, that not, did not work. Anyways, uh, did back to building this hidden escape route. What we gotta do is build a long tunnel so that we can go far, far away from the base. Okay, and yeah, let's go as far as possible. Yep, we just gotta build a really big, long tunnel. We don't need to make this place look nice or anything, because that's gonna take way too long. Let's just build really, really far out, and then at the end, we could have our own plane runway. Wait, 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 wait. Are we under any buildings right now? And wait, hold on. That's a good question. Uh, let's check later, though. Let's just keep going farther. We gotta go really far. Okay, I'm gonna dig. I'm gonna dig. Wait, I got Guys, I got a question. Wait, what's your question, Cam? What's your favorite flavor of candle? Well, a flavor of candle? I don't you don't I don't think you're supposed to eat candles. Fruit! 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 What type of fruit? Mango. Mango candles? Yeah. 
I like my candles uh, raw. Oh, what? Don't you like light them on fire? Aren't they all cooked technically? Uh, no, no, no. I, I I do without flavoring and without fire. What? Do you like it as candle soup? Sometimes. Only on Saturdays. What are you guys talking about? Candles? Okay, but hold on. Anyways, guys, I, I think we should be far and away enough from our main base now. Look, our main base is all the way over there, and we're all the way over here. I think now it's time we start digging up. Okay, let's do that. All right, let's go. Here, I'm just going to start digging up this way really quick. And All right, moment of truth. Is there any buildings around us? And oh, let's go, guys. I don't see any buildings around here. We dug straight up into the forest. Let's go. This is awesome. Good, 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 good. Okay, this is actually perfect. But now we got to build a plane runway up here. So what we can do is literally just have a ladder going up here. Since no one's going to be this deep into the forest, we just have a ladder going up here like this. And then let me grab a little bit of gray concrete. And let's just build our very own private plane runway over here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, we gotta yeah. make this place super hidden. We do not want anyone finding it. Yeah, and I think there's enough room for us to fly, but these trees might get in the way. Oh, don't worry. I got it. And Oh, gosh. Yeah, you're right. And Wait, what, what do you mean? We're just gonna do... Uh, let's see. That works. And let me grab uh, one of these. There we go. All right. Now we can just uh, we'll do a little and, bit uh, of... Uh, wait, hold on. I, I, okay. I think we're deep enough in the forest that no one's gonna care about this one tree. Oh, oh you're just burning all up. Okay, let's just uh, get, destroy some of these trees by ourselves. But there's so many trees. Oh, wait, it's on fire. Yep, we gotta get rid of them somehow. Moki the bear says start forest fires. Oh, gosh. All right, well, guys, make sure the fire doesn't spread. If the fire spreads into the rest of the forest, then we're gonna be in some real trouble. I don't think we should be using fire in the first place, Cam. Yeah, that wasn't really the best idea. Flame on. Cam, if you start a forest fire, I will not forgive you. Yeah, Cam, if you start a forest fire, I think you're gonna be in bigger trouble than that Steven guy. Fine, I'll blow it out. <laughs> Uh, uh, whoa, 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 what are you doing? Uh, oh, wow. You really blew it all out. All right. Well, guys, let's just take on these trees over here by hand. We just got to get rid of this tree right over here. We got to clear out some space for our runway. Yep. Um, let's see here. Actually, wait. We don't even have to dig out the entire tree. All we got to do is just dig out a little channel over here for our runway to go through. Yeah. Just like that. And okay, I think this should be enough room to take off now. We just need um, the plane to have some room to go up. That's all. Yeah, this is perfectly enough of space. I think we got plenty of room over here. This should work. This is kind of cool looking. It is pretty cool looking. It's just a random runway in the middle of the forest. I hope no one uh, sees it, but uh, what kind of plane do we put down? Mm, let's see. Let's see. We got to find something really fast. So wait, hold on. What about this crimson large plane? This thing looks pretty cool. Whoa, this thing is huge. Wait, I like this one. I like the color of this one. Yeah, and wait, look, it's also got two seats. And wait, hold on. Is that a third one in the back? Can someone fit in there? Wait, Ruby, try getting in. And then Cam, try getting in the very back. Is, is, is this a three-seater or a two Two seater. All right, let me hop in, boss. Uh, it's not working. And, oof. All right, I guess it's only a two seater. In that case, what we can nah, do nah, nah, is it's a three seater. Just get going. Uh, wait, you're, you're gonna stand on top. Uh, I don't think that's a good idea. We should probably just spawn in another plane. No. Here, how about we just spawn in uh one normal plane over here for the additional person? Yeah, we can just have it facing that way. Yeah. All right. Well, I'll drive this one. Oh, no, I want to drive that one. No, I want to drive this one. I want to be by myself. Wait, I want to be in the back of whoever's plane actually. So I no, I want to drive this one. Well, guys, I'm already inside of the front one, so there's mine. Uh, fine, I'll take the big one. All right. Well, anyways, I think that should be everything we need. We've got the escape route. We've got the hidden bunker. I think we should be safe here from the cops. Let's go. All right, well, now that this is done, let's just go back to the base and get some snacks. I'm hungry. And yeah, that sounds good. All right. Well, anyways, uh, what type of snacks does everyone want? FBI, open up. Uh, wait, did you guys hear that? I think we're in some trouble. Uh, maybe it's for somebody else. No, I think it's for us. To the escape route. Oh man, I wanted to eat a snack. That was pretty crazy. And if you want to watch the next video, then click on the video on the screen right now.